you have all sorts of things go through your head when something like that happens but you just gotta you gotta move on and hopefully god willing everything will be okay and what happened will never happen again We're leaving the Blue Water Casino, and you know the drill. <laughs> yeah, I know the drill. I know the drill. You know the drill. It's sad because this is the time we're leaving for the season, you know, and we probably won't be back until next late fall. We're heading north, and so we're leaving Arizona, going to be leaving Arizona, and it's so hot here today, by the way. It's hot, really hot. Parker weather. It's 87 degrees and mostly <laughs> sunny in Parker. It's 87 degrees and mostly sunny, getting up to 92. 92 today. Oh, 98 tomorrow again and then 95 Tuesday. So <laughs> it's really calling for some hot weather. So we are glad to be going. We're going to Kingman. It's supposed to be about 10 degrees cooler. Still not as cool as we would like, but much better than this. Uh, definitely much better than this. This is just too much. It's, it's been it's been a stressful week, and I'm glad to be headed out of here because of the heat. But I kind of have mixed feelings about it also because I know we're probably leaving for the season, and it has been stressful over the last week and a half or so, going back to last week. But I just got to get back on track. That's all. I mean, I'll be honest, I'm a little afraid of getting back on a saddle and doing this after that wheel came off. You have all sorts of things go through your head when something like that happens. But you just got to you got to move on and hopefully, God willing, everything will be OK. And what happened will never happen again. I hope so. It was scary. I was a little scared today, too, at the thought of driving again. And, you know, you have this fear if it, you know, is it going to happen again? But hopefully it won't happen again. And luckily we were safe. That's the most important thing. But Sal is sporting what I like to call the grubby look. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he hasn't shaved in, oh, I don't three know. Three days. How, how many? Three days. Three days now. Sal has not shaved in three days. But... I think he kind of does this sometimes when he's going through a little bit of a rough patch. So. <laughs> yeah. He's done it before. You should have seen him. Uh, I don't know. Was it the year before we left Buffalo? I think not that long before we left Buffalo, he was shaving about once every two or three days. Yeah. But then we ended up getting him an electric razor and he's been doing better, but I don't know. I think I was just so stressed out that and I just haven't thought about shaving over the last few days. So we're going, I think about, oh, I don't know, 80, 80 or 90 miles. And uh, so it won't be a, a long trip. And so I guess that's about it. I guess it's time to say, almost time to say bye to Arizona. We won't be in Arizona for a little while. We still don't know which way we're going. We just know we're going to Kingman today. <laughs> and then we're either going to go down 40 to Flagstaff and through New Mexico or we're going to go up into Utah we're not sure yet we're going to decide I guess tonight or tomorrow so hey right. yeah we'll pray on it and think about it and we'll go from there okay let's check in with the boys oh she more how are you Henry everybody looks cozy you cozy there wasn't much protest either after that long trip back and forth to Phoenix. Timo was not happy when we were just coming back from Phoenix, getting close, probably the last half hour or hour of the trip, he was very vocal. Of course, it might have been partly to do with food too, but <laughs> anyhow, everybody's nice and peaceful and calm and hopefully Sal will be calm once he gets going. Yeah, I'm a little nervous, but God willing, God's with us. He's always with us. So, All right, here we go. And there is a buffet today, but we did not go. We didn't go. We didn't want to. So hopefully we'll get some buffets along the way. All right, let's go.
All right. You ready? Ready. Oh. I'm ready. Check the tire. I'm gonna get out and check it. Set. I'm gonna get out and check the tire. Okay. It's already getting... Seems okay. What Sal's gonna do? He's gonna check the tires. <laughs> this is the third time. We're in, uh, I don't know where we are. We're north of Lake Havasu. And he's gonna go check them. Yeah, I, I think I need to check them every once in a while and make sure everything's okay. <laughs> this is what Sal does. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Has to go after my food. That would he be wouldn't warm. be Seymour if he didn't go after my food. Okay, Seymour. Seymour says, if you enjoyed the video, click like and subscribe. Seymour says, we want to hear from you, so please leave a comment. Seymour says, tell all your friends about him. Seymour says, thanks for watching. <laughs>